Hey guys, welcome to the channel and my very first complete fishing video. I thought I would start out by talking basics and in general about one of the most popular fish down here on the south coast, the Aussie Salmon, Aripish Cretaceous. This video is just a few clips I put together from old footage of some salmon fights. There's plenty more other clips to come. In every case of these vids, patience is key, whether on the rocks or the beach. As most fishers know, pretty much goes for all large fish in most circumstances. Sometimes, of course, there's not much you can do but hang on. What's going on, mate? High speed. High speed. There's me getting spooled. <laughs> But most of the time you have some measure of control. Now these guys are a very big version of our Tommy Ruff or Herring and are in fact cousins. You don't need to catch them off the rocks because when they're running, they're everywhere and anywhere. But if you do, make sure that PFD is always on and check your rocks beforehand. We'll be going over some general rock safety tips in another episode. Salmon really are a fun and versatile fish and a great fish to learn the drag system, especially for new fishes. A lot of people like catching it, and if you like herring, you most likely will like salmon. Whether it's to eat or for bait, heaps of tourists and anglers come down south to catch them and even hitting the metro when they're on their migratory run. Chasing the salmon you may see them in large schools, but they also may just as well be low in the water column and in much smaller groups. Like herring, you can catch them on lures and catch them on bait. All that really matters is the size of the hook. Stay tuned to the end of the video, I'll show you an easy way to gain your pilchards that I was taught for those that have trouble.
I hit Dr. Hook, nice. Okay, guys, Bab here, just out having another fish and thought I'd throw another tip your way. Got lots of episodes to come, lots of ideas. I can't wait to get them out to you all. Slide baiting and whatnot. How I was taught to uh, gang your mules up and uh, over the years have been very successful in this manner so I thought I'd share it backbone on one side the hook gang backbone and the same side your backbone of your muley line up the top hook of the muley to the eye find where it reaches on the bottom and begin planting your hook one two and three third one through the skull helps in casting the skull is part of the strong strongest part of the fish along with the spine give it a bit of a yank if there is extra sometimes this one is not too bad fish come and take a bite they'll get it but uh, if there is extra sometimes i will like to just cut the muley on an angle like that and it's nice and close Great for Taylor, salmon and bait casting. Till next time, yeah.